Hey collective, we're gonna do a quick energy check, see what your spirit guides, ancestors, universe, the divine wants you guys to know as you're navigating through your journey to ascend to your highest good. I've already meditated sage called in the appropriate protection. Okay. How you guys doing today? divinity helping others free others out of bondage some of you guys are akashic um, record readers spirit said you guys are unique in so many ways the seeds that you're planting is growing intuitive those are very intuitive um cleanse your chakras yeah a lot of you guys are getting visions spirits that get plenty of rest transformation okay let's see okay five 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 changes know 555 means changes okay we have high priestess high priestess is highly intuitive psychic has um direct connection to spirit um you you guys are helping others free others out of bondage spirit wants you guys to get plenty of rest the seeds that you guys are are planting are growing okay a lot of you guys are cleansing your chakras um some of you guys may be seeing elephants Elephants are very intuitive, like they're very, very smart animals, okay? So for it to come out with the high priestess, that's like a double confirmation. Visions, a lot of you guys are getting visions. There's been a transformation. Um, you stepped into your divinity. A lot of you guys are Akashic record readers, okay? <clears throat> Spivit said you're unique in so many ways. You're unique in so many ways. to be authentic and step into your divinity you're tapping into your hidden power spirit said right now stepping into your divinity you're focusing on self building self building connection with spirit right now you're not letting the outside interference um distract you guys
Yeah, you're letting the baggage go, Spirit said. Spirit said some of the things that you guys could um can do to help connect um to source, the Om chanting. Go on to YouTube and look up Om chanting meditation. A lot of you guys, your family don't approve of, of you stepping into this, into your divinity. You guys are like, I'm stepping into it regardless. Family don't approve. You're like, I'm not here to people please you. Whoa, people pleaser. Release the need to people please. Okay, spirit. You're loving and accepting yourself. Akashic record readers. Wow. Savage. <laughs> yeah, you're removing drama, chaos, conflict, people who are not in alignment with you, who are not vibrating on the same frequency. Like, I'm done with that. I'm no longer doing that. I have a purpose here, and I'm going to use my spiritual gifts to help uplift humanity, uplift others. Cut through the fear, Spirit said. Wow. Transformation. You're honoring your uniqueness. Okay, Spirit. Ascension. <laughs> the ultimate comeback. A lot of you guys are clear... clear Clear aliens that smelling odors, perfumes. Look, another get plenty of rest. You guys are going through an ascension. Spirit said, get ready. Success, travel, and new life. transformation baby yeah 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 you're done dealing with these type of people vindictive trying to boggle you down trying to make you feel small because you're stepping into your divinity you're like i don't have to deal with this bullshit i'm done i'm done spirit said you're unique in so many ways get ready a lot of you guys are going through an ascension. You're feeling lethargic, tired, like extremely low on energy right now. What else, baby? New beginnings are coming for you guys. Doors are opening for you guys. Visualize success. Visualize success. You guys are highly clairvoyant. I'm not dealing with those kind of people. You're not letting them taint your spirit. Wow. You're no longer. Spirit said make bigger wishes. <clears throat> you're no longer allowing them to taint your spirit. You're like, you're not gonna, you're not gonna, you, what you think, it, that does not matter. It doesn't matter. You, your your opinion of what I'm doing, it, it's it, it's not it's not gonna stop me from from stepping into my life calling, my life purpose. You're you're you're, you're being authentic. Your family doesn't approve, and you're like, I don't care. I don't care. You're releasing the need to people please. That's dope. Vindictive people that try to stop you, that try to create blockages, obstacles. Spirit said, get plenty of rest. The seeds that you're growing, that you're planting are growing. Ultimate comeback. Whoa. 
visualize success. You're letting the baggage go, the need to people please, the worry, the concern of how other people feel. You're like, that's not my opinion. You're tapping into your, your power. If you don't want to support me and be a supportive family, friend, whatever, then I have to, I have to sabotage here. Because I know what I know, and I'm stepping into my, my calling. And I get it. I know that. I tell you guys this all the time. When I started my, my, my spiritual awakening, when it happened to me, I lost everybody. Yeah, you're cutting through the fear. I lost everybody. Highly clairvoyant. Spirit said, get ready for success. Visualize it. Get ready. Success, travel, new life. What, Spirit? <laughs> A lot of you guys are Akashic Record readers. Some of you guys are getting visions. Mediums, clairvoyant, clair aliens. You guys are on, on, on savage mode right now, Spirit said. Oh, shit. Okay. Strength. You're getting the strength to move forward. Okay, Spirit. You're standing in your truth. Ace of, um, Queen of Swords. She's really, she severed ties. You're like, I'm done. I'm done trying to people, please. You don't approve. I got it. We got to sever. We got to sever ways here. This is where we separate. What I'm doing is not, it's not affecting you. It's not affecting your, your life, your stability, your home, your family in no way. If you can't be supportive towards me and me stepping into my, my, my calling, this is where we end past here. cannot make this up chariot star this is fast moving fast um forward movement the star what did what the spirit say get plenty of rest the seeds you are planting are growing the ultimate come back visualize success wow whoa the wheel of fortune this right here, it talks about fate, success, your destiny. You're stepping into your calling. You're stepping into your calling. And you're anybody who's not in alignment in the same frequency, you're like, I got to let you go. Wow. What else, Spirit? And you're doing it with unconditional love because you're tired of living like this. Look. You're tired. You're walking away to evolve. Living your joyful life. Knowing this if this makes you happy, whatever this is that you guys are doing, why can't your family or friends or whoever this is be happy for you? Instead, they have you all up in your head wanting you to hide who you truly are. You're like, I can't do this shit no more. It's becoming too much. You had to walk away to evolve. You're, you're not letting these people taint your spirit anymore. Oh, shit. There's been a transformation here. You're done dealing with those kind of vindictive people. You can't love me and, and, and support me. You guys look high pre oh shit high priestess working on yourselves working on your crafts working on on your journey working on yourself first and foremost building that connection with spirit look at you guys don't tell me you're not working the cards say it you are working diligently on yourself building up those pentacles building up that that strength that spiritual strength connecting directly with spirit 
tapping into your hidden powers. Wow. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Building your stability, doing it with confidence, building your empire, because you know the, the emperor deals with stability, okay? Loving yourself, and spirit is gifting you with this. Look at this hand. That hand is coming straight from the, the sky. That's, that's directly from divine, the most high, gifting you with this. Gifting you with this ability, gifting you with this spiritual gifts. You got people talking about you, making making it seem like you're going crazy or something. Like, and all you're doing is building up yourself. You're stepping in your calling. Why is me stepping in my calling affecting you? How does that affect you? Anyone who, who stops, who, who's in your way, you're a queen of, of, of swords. You're severing those ties. You're like, I'm done. Spirit said, make bigger wishes. Make bigger wishes because they're coming. Make bigger wishes. Mm -hmm. And you guys are doing this with love. With love. You're like, I gotta, I gotta go. I gotta go. <clears throat> You're like, I gotta go. What else access to the highest white light? Those seeds that you guys are planting, they're growing. Spirit said, get ready, the ultimate comeback. Visualize success. R remain visualizing success. others out of bondage you guys are highly intuitive high priestess came out here twice and the and the queen of cups and the queen of wands and clairvoyance and mediums akashic readers you, you guys are getting visions where's the other one clairvoyance You guys are highly intuitive and you're using your gifts to help others how how what is so wrong about the gifts that the divine that god gave you what is so wrong about it cosmic sapphire act with honor and integrity speak your truth there's nothing wrong about what you're doing and you shouldn't be ashamed or have to hide that create your vision do what makes your heart sing. You are being nudged forward. What is so wrong about me using my spiritual gifts to help others? Nothing. You're daring to be vulnerable. You're like, I don't care about what anyone else is thinking. I know what I know deep down in my heart. How, how is me stepping into my journey, my awakening, affecting your home life, your money, your stability? It's not. And guys, I say this to you guys all the time. <sighs> yeah, you're building your light body, accelerating your ascension. What? The, look, ascension came out. You guys are going through an ascension. Spirit said shower of blessings open yourself to receive it and pay it forward I cannot make this up I say this all the time you know when when you have people that are against what you're doing okay you got to you got to look at it from a, a higher perspective okay it's not that person okay it's their soul 
your light is triggering those people's demons okay and i say this in all my videos all my videos um you when you when you wake up into your spiritual calling your spiritual journey the people that you were like this with you're not going to be like that with them no more you're going to lose a lot of friends family jobs places people things a lot of that old stuff of what you used to people used to hang out with you're going to start seeing that you just don't resonate with them anymore and it's not it's not nothing that they're doing it's not nothing you're doing you're just not on the same frequency you not you guys are not vibrating you're being called to awaken to use your spiritual gifts um and a lot of times when we're awakening our light starts to trigger those people's demons and they start acting vindictive talking shit making fun of you acting like what you're doing is wrong trying to stop you from doing it it's not about a person's the flesh it's not about the flesh it's about a person's soul and i say this all the time it could be your own husband, your own kid, your mother, your father, your sister, your brother, your aunt, your cousin. Okay? Um, if it's like, let's say, like your husband or your wife. Okay? You guys could sit there early, you know, all day. I love you. Ooh. But when you guys lay down at night, you that person so secretly hates you. They're fighting you at night. Your souls are fighting because you're triggering their demons, okay? So you guys gained a higher perspective of what the fuck is going on. It's a spiritual warfare. You're not going to be on the same frequency with everyone. A lot of these people, you're going to have to cut them out of your life. You're going to have to get Queen of Swords on them. You're going to have to because they're not vibrating on the same frequency. And a lot of you guys are standing in your strength you're walking away and you're no longer allowing them to make you feel like this you're not you're getting your strength walking away and no longer allowing them to have you in your head making you feel like there's something wrong with you you're like no i was born with these gifts there's nothing wrong with me i can't help that god decided to choose me to awaken at this time to use my gifts to help free other people out of bondage i can't help that i was born with these gifts as a psychic i can't help that i see dead people i can't help that i'm highly clairvoyant i can't help that there's no there's no turn off button and if you cannot be supportive of me at this time when i need you the most queen of swords And you guys are doing this with confidence. A lot of you guys are walking away from homes, jobs. Spirit said, <laughs> quick forward movement, star, destiny, the will of fortune. What does Spirit say? The ultimate comeback. Visualize success. Get plenty of rest. from the fear from the judgment the doubt of others you're not allowing others to project doubt fear criticism onto you making you doubt yourself transformation baby look it transformation twice transformation there's been a transformation somebody is stepping up for themselves and their guard, their their guides, got, look at ready. Anybody who comes in and tries to even attempt. Oh snap, spirit! Okay, you're being fearless. You're not scared no more. Spirit said, "Get ready, success, new life, traveled." Whoever this is for, who? Your 
you're being a savage. What else, baby? <laughs> and you're doing it with unconditional love. Unconditional love. You're getting Queen of Swords on these people with unconditional love. You're like, okay, I see where this is going. This is changes. Five, five, five changes. This is a past life issue you've had in your past life. In your past life, you didn't get to complete your mission, Spirit said. This was an issue in your past life. You're completing the mission now. You're letting go of control. And you're allowing Spirit to guide you. Some of you guys are being forced to move and retreat from these people. What the fuck? I just said that. Leave home. Yeah, because you're dealing with deceptive people. Some of you guys are being forced to leave homes. Walk away from people that you've grown, you grew up with. Because they're being deceptive. <sighs> Spirit said it's okay. Bright future coming in bright future coming in you can no longer heal these family issues these people are being deceptive to you and you're realizing that you're realizing that you're realizing that whoever this is for you 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 know who this person is who these people are cycles of rhythm you're in flow you're getting in flow you're, get, you're, you're getting in flow with those energies, with your spirit guides, with the universe. Cycles of rhythm. You've done this in your past life. You're not, you're breaking it now. Transformation. Oh, shit, spirit. Okay, this is a lot. This just drained me. Angel number three, four, five encourages you, encourages you to trust the universe to bring you opportunities and solutions that match your passion, talents, and interests. Whoever this is for, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. And I know it's not easy because I that was me. When I first got, Archangel Michael was heavily protecting you. Just know that. <sighs> okay, spirit. It's heavy for this person, but you're in flow right now, Spirit said. Spirit's proud of you. Shower of blessings, a bright future, the ultimate comeback. Non-believers are going to believe. People that laughed at you, doubted you, called you crazy. That That's what happened to me. That's what happened to me. I lost everybody. I literally stood with like maybe one or two people out of everybody. I still got people talking shit about me. But you know what? I knew what was how I knew there was something going on with me within self around me that I couldn't see. When I started, my ears were ringing for months. I couldn't get that ringing out of my ear for months. It wasn't one, it was both my ears. The vibration frequency was, it was a lot. And you guys are like, I'm not letting you take my soul no more. I'm done. I'm done. Whoever this is for, I'm very proud of you guys, okay? Love and light. Bye.